All right, time now to talk travel and skiing specifically. Yeah, joining us for her first of what we hope many visits is Kim Marie Evans, and her website is luxurytravelmom.com, coming to us from Greenwich. Thanks for being here. Thank you. It's exciting. Thank yeah. you for having me. How did, how did you get into the travel industry and knowing all about these things? Well, you know, I actually started traveling. I have four children, and I wanted to travel, and my husband couldn't always come with me, so I finally just started going, <laughs> and I would, I would send him the itinerary and say, hey, you know, it'd be great if you could join us. This is where we'll be. And <laughs> there you are. And, your and four there children. I am with my four children. And people seem to be fascinated with the fact that I would pick up with four children and leave. So I started writing about it. And what are the age ranges? They, they, I had them all within seven years, but okay. now they are ages 10 to 17. Okay. okay. So, that's so it's good. easier now than it was back then. They can right. carry their own bags. Which now, if you're, the daunting task, I think, for skiing specifically is what you're going to talk about here is getting started, especially with little ones. Like, what's step one? Because the idea of bringing two little ones who don't know how to ski to a mountain is kind of intimidating. It can be very intimidating. I think this is one of the hardest sports, and no offense to all the dads, it usually falls to the mom. Mm. You know, how, what am I going to pack? How do I get them dressed? How do I find the right ski school program? And I actually found this great resource where you can actually rent ski clothes for your children. Seriously? So, seriously. Ski clothes. Ski, ski clothes. clothes. What is that? <laughs> I know, right? Yeah. I, it's, what, it's what I wish I had thought of, right. actually. It's called Kit Lender. Mm. And you can go online and rent an entire box of ski clothes close for three days for your children it's about $69 and then if they like it then I would suggest you invest because buying ski clothes is not cheap. Do you right. have the option to buy after renting? You do. Huh? You do. So if you like it you can just send them and be like all right I'm just gonna yeah, buy it. Yeah I'm just gonna keep this. Exactly. That is a genius idea. It okay. Is, it is a genius idea but regardless you know getting them dressed really is the first step. I have four children and you know the ski clothes just pass you know from right. top to bottom. And so it's all, I, I believe we're putting up the packing list on your website. Okay. That's really, it's exactly what you need to pack for each child for a weekend ski trip. Okay, and if you just want to start um, locally, you found some ideas, some even smaller mountains, maybe you're just gonna go for the day and check it out, like get your feet wet. I think that's the perfect way to do it. If you're new to skiing and you want to just see, do I like this, does my child like it? There are a lot of small mountains nearby. I like Mohawk. It's a great mountain. They have ski programs. You can do your ski rentals right there. It's very easy. And if you don't know how to ski, which I think that's the real crux for a lot of moms, yeah. is I want my kids to ski, but I don't know how to ski. They actually offer a group ski lesson. It's an hour and a quarter for $30. That's really so good. So you can get out on the mountain and see if you like it. And you would do it your own lesson while your kids are going while to ski school? your kids are in their own lesson. So you don't really recommend adults and kids taking a lesson together? Well, that's actually a great way to do it. We've done that where we've hired a private instructor that's taken out the family. But it's better if you all already know how to ski. Okay. Where okay. else? Where else should we ski? Where, everywhere. Is, where, where, everywhere. Where, you should be skiing of, everywhere. Where are some of your favorite mountains? <laughs> we ski at Mount Snow every weekend. Yeah, that's a great mountain. It's a great mountain. It's the closest, it's the southernmost Vermont mountain. When my kids learned to ski, we went to Stowe. I love Stowe. I love every mountain. There's not mm -hmm. a mountain I don't love. Yeah. Show me a mountain. I love that mountain. But it's about getting there. So we drive up to Mount Snow every weekend. Every weekend. Every weekend on Friday night. What is it, you two will and find a half? it's three and a half hours and from half. Greenwich. Okay. And we even we even take the dogs and the cat. So it's a it's a ah, little hillbilly. The cat, <laughs> too? Cat Do the cat ski? The cat the cat does not ski. <laughs> but so I drive that SUV. Do you know a cat that <laughs> likes the cold? No. <laughs> <laughs> With four kids, two dogs and a cat. And we go up every weekend. It's what we do. It's our passion. This is what we do as a family. We're a ski family. Okay, so it, it, that's maybe a goal, but if you're just getting started and you want to just Don't see. Don't the cat if you're just no, getting no. started. So maybe start with a day trip. And how long, what, do you, what should you estimate? Is it a whole season until your kids will kind of be able to ski on their own? Is it a few days? I mean, how long does it take to get people skiing? That is a really great question. It's about 20 minutes for some kids. It really and is. They're low to the ground. They're made of cartilage. They have no fear. No fear. <laughs> they have no fear. <laughs> okay. And uh, I also, I highly suggest bribing. That has okay. worked for me. Ski, so, and then I take you and you get whatever and you, you get, want from you get, like, cocoa you get a fried hot food. Cocoa, a lot of mountains. Mount Snow has a waffle cabin. It is, oh my gosh. A waffle in, cabin. A waffle cabin, and you ski up to it, and they make these hot Belgian waffles. Oh, we are going. And they drip chocolate on get, the top of it. I've spent more I'll money on waffle you. cabin. If we take my kids and you help. <laughs> Do they know how to ski? No, I'm going to. That's why, that's why you're going. 
Okay, Marie, you're coming with us as well. I'll go with you. Right, if so you're for, buying the waffles, I'm in. For more great travel tips, check out Kim Marie's website, luxurytravelmom.com. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you. It's been awesome. All right. I Happy really skiing. want you to get up skiing. I'm excited well, about this. I ski, got, so I want them to. you got to get the kids on I, the mountain. Yeah, all right. So this is gonna I'm going to look. Good. check out your packing list and go slow. Thank all you right. so much. You're welcome.